There we go. Central Bank of West York. Look at all these ATMs out here. Okay. Nice looking bank. Good day, sir. How are you? Can I talk to you? No. All right. You just do your job. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to take a look at a new game coming out to Steam called Trader Life Simulator 2. This game will release on December 8th on the Steam platform. And I do want to throw out a huge thank you to DNA Army Gaming for sending me an early key to this game. Now, I played Trader Life Simulator about a year ago on my channel, and I really liked the game. And so they came out with a new updated version. I have not watched any video of it. I've, I've seen the video on the Steam page, and the graphics look really, really nice. They've done a lot of work on the graphics, it looks like. They've also added some new features. We now have uh, more slots to carry items. There's more shops. They have more furniture shops. I think there's clothing shops now. There's also quests in the game. So they've done a lot of updating to the game, so I'm really excited to jump in and take a look at it. Uh, I like this opening menu. We do not have any character creation options. We're just going to be this dude right here. So let's jump in and start a new game. Again, I've not played it at all. We're gonna, this is going to be brand new to us. All right, we do have a tutorial. Welcome to Trade Life Simulator 2. First of all, get in your car. So it looks like we have $350 to start out with. Our house is totally unfurnished. Looks like we do not have a stairs in this game. Yeah, other game we had an upstairs, we would go to the bathroom. Our bathroom was up there. All right. Game looks good. Uh, we've got some got a nice lake out here. Yeah, looks nice. All right, let's get in our car. Get a nice little compact. Open your map. Press M to open your map and find your shop. All right, so this map looks a lot like our old map. So our shop is right here. We are right here, so it looks like we've got a straight shot down to our shop. Go to your shop, all right. There's the police department. There's a clinic. Guessing that's like a doctor's office. Okay, so maybe our shop's right over here. Yeah. Top Daily right here. That's our new shop. Alright, take the shelf in front of the shop door by pressing T on it and place it in, inside the shop. Okay, E to get out. Clean the mess. Alright, T to pick up. Now you see down at the bottom we've got five inventory slots. Now we used to only have one. Place it inside the shop, okay. Shop open for customers. Oh, we already got a guy working for us. Cool. Alright, take the shelf in front of the shop door by pressing T on it and place it inside the shop. All right, let's put our first shelf over here. Uh, left mouse button to place. How do I rotate? Okay, it's simple enough. Rotate. All right, that looks pretty good. Now we can pick it back up if we need to. Take the box by pressing left mouse button on it and place it inside the shop. Okay. Come about the box over here. All right, cereal. Very nice. All right, now we probably need to put it down here, and then F four boxes of cereal. I can only grab still only grab one at a time. Or what if I do this? There we go. We can move. We can move our, our use our mouse wheel to move 
to the next slot. Okay, that's all right. There we go. Press Q to open your tablet. I'm sorry, what did it say after that? How do we get out of the tablet? Press Q to open your tablet and check the How to Play app. Okay. How to play. Welcome to Trader Life Simulator 2. This is your shop where you sell products that you buy from wholesalers around the town. This is your worker. He will handle the cash register. You don't have to worry about customers. You have to pay him daily and you can train him using the staff app in your tablet. Oh, that's nice. You can train him. Train him daily. This is your main shop door. If the store is open, this means the shop is open for customers. And if it's closed, this means no customers will come to your shop. Okay. Customers will never buy a product that is placed on the floor. Okay, that's new. We used to be able to place products on the floor and they would still buy them. Products must be placed on shelves to be sold. Okay, that's nice. I mean, it's more work, but um, that's okay. Customers will, now, will not buy boxes of products. So you need to take products out of the boxes and start shelving them. Okay. When you're out of stock, you can visit Jobber's shop to restock your shop. But you need to deliver the products by one of your vehicles. All right. Some products require being stored in a fridge. If you put them on shelves, they will rot. That's not new. Your shop rating is very important to unlock new products. Check the shop rating app in your tablet to know how it works. All right, shop rating. You need to manage hunger, thirst, health, bladder, and dirtiness. Visit the player status app in your tablet to know more. All right, that's dirtiness. Uh, food or water is below 10%. You can't run. That was all in the, in the original game. The bank is very important to get a Visa card add, and add money to it to be able to use most of the tablet apps. Okay. You need to pay your bills using your bills app in your tablet. To pay bills, you need to have a Visa card with money in it. All right. There's a new ATM. Once you have a Visa card from the bank, you can start using the ATM machines around the town. That's handy. App Store app in your tablet allows you to install new apps to your tablet. All right, so we have shop management delivery vehicle. Okay, that's cool. We can add apps. Check complaints app in your tablet to know what products are missing from your shop. Very nice. We used to have this on our phone. Purchase the shop upgrade app to upgrade your shop for more profit. You can't use vehicles to transport furniture. You can you you can you can use vehicles to transport boxes only, okay? And you can't use the trunk of the car since it's too small. If you want to load massive amounts of boxes, you need to buy the pickup truck. Okay, so that used to be kind of a kind of a workaround. You could stack a bunch of boxes on the top. So okay, now how do we get out of this app? There we go. Uh, shop rating. We're at zero. We have $350, no money in the bank, and we need to buy a Visa card. The App Store. Okay, you have to buy the apps. All right, I don't want to do that yet. Staff. Worker training. Oh, it costs $500 for training. Ooh. Train your worker will increase his work speed and daily salary. It will also increase customer's walking speed. Okay. All right, we'll wait on that. We don't have very much money right now. Uh, no sales. Flashlight, okay. Bills, we can, all right. All right, so we'll get back into that. Red light to get out. All right, let's get some of our, do I still have that flashlight on? Let's get some of our product here. No, I want the whole box. Toilet paper. I sold a box of cereal already. Thank you, sir. All right, to grab the whole box, left mouse, and then I scroll to the next. Yeah. Okay, that's awesome. So I got chips, milk cookies, frying oil, and wrapped papers. All right, let's put the wrapped papers here. The frying oil. Uh, I'm going to put the gum over here on the counter. 
and maybe the chips. Let's see how big they are. Let's put the cookies here. Alright, so that's pretty handy. We used to only be able to carry one at a time. Uh, let's see the cookie. Let's put the frying oil on here. F. It's take it. All right. Let's put the frying oil up here. So a little more work because we can't just leave it on the floor like we used to be able to, but that's okay. Alright, now what, let's see, how do we check our stats, like our personal player status right here. Alright, so our health, food, water, bladder, and dirtiness is all okay right now. So that's the player status, that's how we access that. Alright, let's see what else we got here. Chips. They will fit there, okay. Pardon me, sir. All right, and then we got gum here. It's a big pack of gum. All right, we should go put the gum right here in front. Sell a few things. We're up to four hundred thirty dollars. All right, hey buddy, can I just talk to you? Uh, there is a quest in the game now. Uh, let's see, can I access this tablet at all? Oh, I do have my flashlight on. Okay, I don't need that on. <laughs> let's turn that off. Uh, okay, I can't really access any of this like I used to be able to. And do we have a way to save the game now? Hey, what's back here? Is this a storage room? Okay, this looks like a storage room, and then we've got a... Yeah, this is probably for jobber delivery back here, I'm guessing. My shell is a little crooked. I can fix that later. Now, do we have a way to save the game? Shop sign app. Oh, I gotta buy that to change my name. Okay. Well, I think that's a little pricey. Notes app. Use notes to write what products are missing from your shop. Okay, we definitely need that. So let's buy that. If you don't have a Visa card, go to the bank to get one. Oh, shoot. Okay. All right, we got to go to the bank get a Visa card. You're looking well-dressed today, sir. All right, let's go check out the bank. Get our map open. We are here. The bank's right across the street. This looks like the bank. Look at all these ATMs here. There we go. Central Bank of West York. Look at all these ATMs out here. Okay. Nice looking bank. Good day, sir. How are you? Can I talk to you? No. All right. You just do your job. You're doing a great job. We got vending machine over here. Can I buy out of this? No. All right. Let's go see. Wow. They've got a lot of security in here. Won't be robbing this bank. All right. Here we go. Let's see if we can buy a Visa card at teller number four. Hello. Request Visa card. Twenty-five dollar fee. All right. Transfer money. Enter amount of money. That then choose transfer operation from below. Uh, I want to transfer money to my Visa card. I think. Uh, let's go $100. Oh, I have to put money in the bank first. Okay. There we go. Oh, I'm putting money in the bank, yes. 
There we go. It's down here, four hundred dollars. Okay. Now I want to transfer a hundred dollars from the bank to my card. There we go. There it is. Okay. Now we should be able to buy the the app app store. We want to buy this notes app and put it. I guess it puts it on our tablet. Um, do we not? I don't think we have it here now. App Store, buy the notes app. There we go. Now, is it on? Yep, there we go. I can write what's missing in here. I have lots of complaints. Alright. No bills to pay yet. Alright, let's go find the shop store. Cool looking bank. They did a nice job on it. I like it. Alright, so where's this where's the store that we buy our food from? Jobber shop is right here. We'll drive down here and we go to the jobber shop and see what we can buy. And how are we doing on our stats? Health is fine, food, water is a little low, bladder, and dirtiness. And we only have $97. What can we do at the ATM? Okay, we can transfer money to the bank. Now we have too much money in the bank. Well, I don't know if we could buy from. The, I don't know if we could buy from the uh, store off our card. Let's go find out. Not sure how that works yet. We got a horn. We have lights on our car. Down the bottom left there it tells you. Yeah. It tells you how to use all your vehicle functions. I would. I would like to be able to just close the map with hitting the M key. We use the M key to open the map, but we have to hit the close button to close the map. That would be nice if they added that. Okay, there's the mechanic shop. Yeah, this looks like the gas station. Yes. So they really have to spread this map out a lot. It's much bigger than uh, the original game. There's Jobber Shop, and there's Electronics Store. Alright, let's go down there, jobbers. Okay, we do have an ATM right outside the door here. So I want to see if I can just buy straight from money from the bank. I've got $75 in my Visa card, and I've got $300 in the bank, and $174. Uh, just honest, I guess. Yeah. Alright. Good day, sir. How are you? Let's see. Can I look at my complaints? Yes. We needed rice, a whole lot of stuff. Uh, dog food. Okay, a lot of things. So now prices do change daily. Just like the other game. High price. You see in the red. Uh, corn snacks, good price. Tea. Normal price 25, current price 22. So what I'm looking for is really, really low prices like this. Tuna cans. Normal price is $80, current price is $60. That's a good buy. Let's buy it. Okay. Um, eggs will probably spoil. Canned corn. I'm just looking for the really good stuff right now. Good prices. So I did take that money out of my cash on hand, I believe. Soda, that's just normal pricing. And again, now we can carry five boxes at a time. And that soda is five dollars under. Or tropical drink, sorry. Okay. Let's see if we can just find some of the stuff that they, they're asking for. Shampoo. Okay, that's a good price. Let's buy it. 
and canned corn. That's going to be in the canned goods. All right, where's my canned corn at? Remember seeing the? Is there a restroom back there we can use? No. Okay. I'm not sure how we use the restroom. That used to be in our house. Do we have to buy a restroom now? Canned corn. All right, that's a good price. Let's buy that. All right. All right, we got five boxes now. Uh, it said I cannot put cannot put boxes in the trunk, right? I think that's what it said. Should be able to stack them. There we go. Alright, we only have $92 left. What's something else that maybe we could see they were complaining about? General dressing. Uh, dog food was a little high, I think. I think we saw that. Canned peas, canned fruits. Let's check out that. Canned peas is too high. Dog food. Canned fruits, too high. Ice coffee over here, maybe. Yep. That requires a fridge. Okay, we can't buy that. We don't have a fridge yet. All right, let's take this back. And can I speak to you? I don't think so. No. Okay. Let's go back and put this on our shelf. Yeah, I'd like to be able to either tab out or hit M to get out of the map key. That would be more convenient. Oh, let's check out the, uh, while we're here, let's check out the electronic shop real quick. Good day, sir. Uh, phone cases. Alright, lots of stuff. Computers, looks like. Can we not buy these? Can't buy those. Interesting. Okay. Why can't I buy any of this stuff? Just for looks? Alright. Well, that's a little disappointing. Can't buy any of this stuff. Only what's up here. Again, the shop looks really nice. Well done. But it looks like these are the only things I can buy. Watches... Phones, tablets, and phone cases, laptops, desktops, and phone stands. Okay. How are we doing our stats? We're going to need some food at some point. You can hear yourself by going to the pharmacy. You can eat drink products from your shop. That's new. Clear bladder by using the toilet. Clean yourself by using the bathtub. You can purchase toilets and bathtubs from furniture stores. Well, I'm probably going to need to buy a used toilet because I don't have very much money. We did go by the used furniture store. I wonder if they have used toilets. <laughs> we went by the used furniture store on the way to our store. It's a little disappointing that we have to buy to change our sign on our store. A thousand dollars, that seems like a lot. But we'll get there. Uh oh. Car stuck. Um, reset vehicle R. Um, uh, car stuck. Okay, they really need to work on some of these um, areas here, because my car is stuck. And the reset vehicle button is not working. 
All right, again, that's something that the developers will fix. They'll work on that. Yeah, that's not working. All right, so let's grab these. Hey, they about cleaned their shelves off. Out, I mean. Alright, let's throw these down. Yeah, so it was definitely a nice feature uh, they added where you can carry five, five items at a time. That will speed things up. Alright. So, we can, uh, let's see, we are hungry. Now, that, oh, that's a new feature. So we can, um, what do I have I can eat here? Can I eat a can of corn? How would I eat this? Place here, cancel, rotate. What if I ate, um, don't have chips over here, gum, curry chips. Oh yeah, so, so some things you can eat, some things you can't. So I can't eat this can of corn, just give me the option. Um, the soda I can drink, okay. Can't eat the tuna. <laughs> but I do have chips over here I can eat. See, it pops up, eat. That's a cool feature. I like that. That was something that's really nice that they added. Alright, so now we are oh, better on food, water, bladder. We have to buy a toilet and we have to buy uh, a tub. Now. Uh, my car I was going to shut this. We're going to close the day. My car's stuck. Was that the used furniture store? Right here. Let's see if we can get this unstuck now. Trying to go backwards, forwards. Yeah, it's not working. It's just stuck. Alright, here we are at the used furniture store. Fortunately, they stay open all night. Now, they have used refrigerators. They have used bathtubs. And they have used toilets. <laughs> Old toilet. I'm going to buy it for $35. <laughs> and I'm going to buy the old bathtub for $75. Because I don't want to buy new stuff right now. <laughs> now, I'm going to... I'm going to throw these in my shop right now. Eventually, we will, we will <laughs> put it in our house. But for right now, we're going to... We're going to throw this stuff in our shop. In the back room. Alright. Let's go on in. And we'll go in this back room here. And we'll put the old bathtub right here. Again, this is temporary. And our old toilet. Let's put it on the other end over here. There we go. Shut the door. Now let's look at our stats right now. Um, dirtiness and a bladder is... Let's see. I guess it goes down this way. So let's just use these. And we'll see what happens. Interact. Okay. And let's take the bath. Everybody close your eyes. Now let's take a look at it. There we go. Our bladder's empty our, and we are clean, so we are all good to go. Alright, now we are thirsty. That's a couple things I want to get done. Was we need a toilet. I'm glad that we could buy used ones because I couldn't afford a new one. Well, my car is stuck. I can't drive to get a new one. So let's take a drink. Uh, let's see. We can drink soda. There we 
go. That got rid of that stat. Yeah, we are not about halfway on our water. Our food is a little less than half, and our health is okay. All right, guys. Well, hey, I'm gonna end this one here. Let's see if we can save, save game. Okay, simple enough. All right, guys. Well, I'm in this one here. Uh, good start to the game, I believe. Uh, I like the things that they've done to the game. The graphics look better. Uh, we have more options now of things to put in our store. We've got clothing, we've got furniture, we've got used furniture. Um, more things to buy and sell. I like that. Uh, they got to get the car thing fixed. Uh, maybe when I reload, my car will be unstuck. Probably will be. Uh, but uh, they need to work on that unstuck button, and they'll work on that, I know. So, hey, if you like this episode, make sure that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, as always, make sure that subscribe button. I appreciate it each and every one of you that subscribes. And if you want to see more of this game, let me know down in the comments section. Again, this is brand new. It comes out December 8th, 2022. And thanks again to DNA Army Gaming Studios for sending me an early key to this game. I'm enjoying it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye for now.